headlines this morning. Ariana Grande has been named the new face of Givenchy on Friday. The singer shared this photo on her Instagram and says she is proud to be a member of the Givenchy family and she feels honored. According to Givenchy, Grande, um, I don't even know what that says. Grande's full winter campaign will be revealed this July. And the Kardashians have officially welcomed another baby boy into the family. It was certainly a surprise for everyone. Kim and Kanye West tweeted about the arrival of their new bundle of joy, saying, quote, he's here and he's perfect. No news yet on the name of the baby boy, but the family is thrilled. I've been seeing things on social media. People are thinking, this time west or south as opposed to north, but we'll see what they come up with. Sophie Turner shared who is to blame for the famous Starbucks coffee cup appearance in the latest season of Game of Thrones. Now, this went viral last week. Apparently, Turner's co-star, Amelia Clark, also known as the mother of dragons, is to blame for the unexpected prop. The star cl uh, came clean after her new husband, Joe Jonas, who has been self-proclaimed as one of her biggest fans, made a surprise video call during The Tonight Show. The cup will be edited out in future streamings. FYI, really, it's Sophie Turner, who is married to Joe Jonas. Everybody thought that, um, that someone was going to get fired, whoever Over did that. that. Yeah, but also, they're not going to fire Danny. <laughs> no, they're going to have no some way. fun with that. And by now, we all know what, that Meghan Markle and Prince Harry have had their baby boy and named him Archie. The pair has not confirmed whether the name is short for Archibald, but sources say that Archie is both a popular name, popular name in Britain and means, quote, truly brave in Germany. I like that. Although some were surprised by the name, Archie may have a special meaning for their royal family. And it has to do with Prince William and Kate Middleton's child, Prince George. The family is ecstatic to welcome their new bundle of joy into the family. And we welcome them into the No Sleep Club. Just like we welcome Just like, yeah, Alan. Alan's baby. On May 9th, you know, at 2.30 in the morning. It's, you know, it was interesting to see all the reactions.